Today, we will be testing the Adaptive Featureized Trend Intensity Index Indicator. But before we do, if you have not watched the first video on the channel and all the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. There is also a link down below to sign up for TradingView. You can save a little bit of money if you use the link below to sign up for your account. You can also find a link below to join us on Discord. Lastly, if you would like a list of all the indicators we have tested along with their win rates, but you aren't interested in watching all the videos on the channel, you can sign up for our $9 Patreon and you will receive the complete list of indicators. We also would like to introduce our Patreon exclusive Discord channel. As a $9 Patreon, you will be invited to join an exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators and links for the MT platform, give you winning strategies, post trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. All right, as I said today, we will be testing the Adaptive Fisherized Trend Intensity Index Indicator. Before we do though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 61 different strategies with 16 of them being profitable. We've also tested a total of 794 indicators with 324 of them being winners. The best ones so far were able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. So go back and watch those videos and see what you can get out of those winning indicators. We've also retested in the advanced testing 21 of the winning indicators. Eight of them have been able to maintain the winning status. The best one, a 76% win rate. Keep in mind that we test most of these strategies and indicators on the Forex and crypto market, but they can be applied to just about any market and time frame universally. Okay, so today's indicator is the Adaptive Fisherized Trend Intensity Index. And you can see it here on the bottom of the screen. Let me scroll this back just a little bit here. It might be a tad bit easier to kind of see what's happening with it. And so we have the uh, main oscillating line here. I did go in and change that just a little bit. And so um, I changed it from a light blue color to this orange color, just so that way it stands out just a little bit more. And you can see that we have a, a kind of overbought and oversold type zone at the top and at the bottom there. And then we have um, some background coloration here. Uh, you can see here, 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 this orange kind of coloration in the background. And so what we are looking for is uh, first, we are looking for the oscillating line to hit one of these extremes. So it either goes um, all the way to the top or all the way to the bottom. And then we are looking for it um, to uh, break back into the center zone. So we've done this uh, quite a few times before. And so uh, for example, if we look right here, get everything in focus here a little bit better. All right, so you can see that uh, the oscillating line comes down and bottoms out right here. And then you can see as it makes its way back up into the center zone and crosses back above this lower band right here, that would be a signal to go long. And over here on this side, when the oscillating line tops out over here, then we are looking for the oscillating line to break back into the center zone. And when it does that, um, every time it crosses into the center zone, it gives this background coloration here. So we can easily see when it actually makes that cross um, back into the center. Then that would be a short right there. So that's what it is that we are looking for. And that's how we're going to test it. And scroll back way far here. 
There we go. All right. Let's get everything back in focus here. All right. There we go. Let's go ahead and get on with the testing and see what we can get out of it. All right, so the first signal that we pick up is a short signal. Uh, you can see that we get uh, the oscillating line is kind of topped out here in the green area, and then it breaks back down into this middle section here, right here on this candle. Uh, looks like we get pretty much an immediate bounce to the upside there. Uh, does look like that has stopped this out. Let me just check our stop and take profit. There it is. Um, no, we might not have gotten stopped out yet. So there to there. Nope, still within our stop. Let's go ahead and keep playing it forward here a little bit. And it looks like we start to make our way to the downside there. And that is enough to come down and get us to our take profit. Let's go ahead and continue on. So you can see that we were bottomed out here. So we made it all the way through this, hit the bottom right here. And then we started to make our way back out uh, here on, don't know if it would give it to us on this one. Let's see here. Eh, for the sake of it, let's just call it good on this one. And we were able to avoid our stop. We made a nice push to the upside. And that one does get us to our take profit as well uh let's see so what i'm going to do now is go ahead and fast forward through the rest of the testing that way things don't get too long and we'll pick this up when we are at the end of the year all right so that's going to put us at the end of the year right there before we take a look at what this was able to achieve i'd like to give a quick shout out to our discord server here so this is our discord server here it's free to join but we do have a channel set up just for our patrons to take advantage of some advanced information that we're putting out for everyone to see so uh, for example our admin jay and one of our members sasquatch here is posting a regular chart analysis of the futures and forex market uh, jay's doing a great job of trading the futures market and sasquatch here uh, is a prop trader in the forex market and like i said they're putting up a regular chart analysis pretty much every single day uh, doing some really great analysis and observations of the market here and giving some really great advice um, as they do so uh, we also give just general advice tips on different strategies um, help the patrons out uh, if they have questions or um, have any concerns about a strategy that they're using or indicator and we just kind of go um, a little bit more thorough into the patreon only channel than we do on the other channels and so there's just a lot of great information in here for everyone to take advantage of highly recommend that you join us here all right back to our indicator here all right so that's pretty clear there so we have the one two three and four trades all together and we have the two winning trades that's going to put us at a 50 percent win rate not going to meet the 60 percent criteria that we are looking for um seemed like it was doing rather well we got a couple of decent signals out of it there uh, but it does look like it is just a little slow to a little slow to kind of uh, understand what the market is doing and so uh, by the time it is um, kind of picking up uh, specific trend directions um, then that move uh, seems to kind of be over in some cases and so uh, you can see here that it is picking up um, kind of an upward movement right here and that is actually coming from this right here and then it starts to go down and it takes it so long for it to understand that it's actually going down that by the time it hits it it's now starting to go back up and so just kind of creates this uh this nasty little uh, seesaw um, effect here where um, it's going down as it's going up and it's uh going uh, up as it's going down and yeah just some some issues and so all in all uh just not going to work for us this one is going to go on the no list and we will move on to the next indicator from here 